All right, Mia says she's excited to meet her online crush, and he will see her as well in the flesh. You've never met him before, right? No. Oh. So how did you get in touch with him or her? Um, he mean? messaged me on Facebook, yeah. and we've been talking for about six to seven months now, and everything was pretty casual, and then it turned into more once he found out that I'm a stripper. Oh. Oh. So, but when he first showed interest in you, he didn't know you were a stripper. Yeah, it was very casual, just like friendly type. Oh, I see. And then you let him know, and then he became even more interested. Yeah. But yeah. Because he's never been to a strip club or even known any strippers. Okay, he told you he never was at a strip club. Yeah. And you believed him. He seemed like it. Really? Did he? <laughs> Uh, and he seems like a nice guy, apparently. Yes. Yeah. And so you've arranged to meet him here today? Yes. Okay. Oh, well, good. And uh, w tell me something about him. Uh, well, he's from Texas. Yeah. He rides bulls in, like, he rodeos. He rides bulls? Yeah, and I don't know anyone who does that, so oh. I thought that was interesting. <laughs> wow. Yeah. And so you're looking forward to meeting him? Now. Yes. Well, good. Okay. Uh, he's outside the studio, so he hasn't heard any of this. But here he is, here's Austin. Mm. Oh my God. Hi. It's nice to finally get to meet you. It's nice to meet you too. I know that you told me that crystals were your favorite. Oh, isn't that nice? Thank you. So, uh, hey, Austin, so you found out she was a stripper. Did that increase your interest? Well, yeah. Yeah. yeah I've never been with a stripper. You've never... You never know, even met one. you never even met one? Yeah. yeah, okay. And you've never been to a strip club? No. Really? Every day of my life. Wow, okay, good for you. And she said that you ride bulls mm -hmm. and... Yeah, I, used, I ride bulls on the weekends and stuff and during the summer with my friends. Wow, that's, yeah. Well, what do you, you just met, so what do you want to say to him? Well, when I come to Texas, you offered, well, I model and I do dance for a living and yeah. I was asked to go to Texas, so he offered... Oh, oh you asked her to come to Texas? No, yeah. he, he offered to let oh, me stay with him, so yeah. I didn't have to stay at a hotel. I see what you're saying, okay. And uh, I offered to let her stay with me and everything. Oh, wow, very nice. And you're gonna stay with him? Now that we met, yeah. possibility. Oh. You happy about that? Yeah, all my friends tell me it's pretty cool to have a... Yeah. <laughs> They'll probably all come over to visit. Yeah, yeah, sure. yeah. <laughs> They'll be waiting there when you, you come in there. Right. And did you get, because he seems pretty shy, like yeah. a really nice guy. I mean, I'm shy too, but not that shy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and do you meet guys like this? Yeah. Or are most of the guys you meet guys that, you know... Really... No, they're more dominant. He's more... You think passive? Yes. Yeah, a yeah. lot. That's the word that came to mind. Who's Roxana? That's my girlfriend. <laughs> You're, you're not as shy as I thought. <laughs> yeah. Well, wait a second. If you have a girlfriend, how is she going to come and stay with you? Uh, she doesn't know about it yet. She doesn't know about it. <laughs> oh, boy. Well, she's here. She, she's backstage. <laughs> you didn't know that he had a girlfriend? <laughs> well, here's Roxana. Hi. Are you really moving her in with you? If she needed a place to stay. <laughs> but we were supposed to move in together. Oh. We planned this. How long have you guys been together? We've been together for 10 months. <laughs> so you started talking to her right after we got together. Pretty close to it. She's just some dirty prostitute. Oh. Oh. Like, why would you want that? Why would you want some dirty whore? 
Well, well, we don't. It's a new experience. It's a new experience. Okay. I mean, sorry. It's <laughs> it is. You don't really seem sorry. Well, maybe your relationship wasn't secure in the first Honey, place. Honey, you don't get to speak. You don't get to speak. Trust me, you don't get to speak. The guy doesn't go you're looking just, if he doesn't have you're one. You're just some used up, washed up little oh, whore. And you look like you're going to church, so. Oh, really? kind of messed up, you might want to fix it. Oh, your okay. whole face messed up. Well, in, in fairness to her, she didn't know anything about you. He's the one that lied. I mean, I didn't know, but I didn't care now. Oh, I see. Doesn't matter. So what are you gonna do? Are you dumping me? Yeah. Did you tell her that you loved her? I have in the past, yes. What happened to wanting to marry me? Just got bored with it. How old are you? 19, fixing to be 20. Okay, wait, well, he's fixing to be 20. <laughs> How old are you? I just turned 18. Nobody thinks how he's treated you is fair or good or nice, but he's 19. So you, you have to take that into account that a guy is 19 and says, whatever he says, you gotta take with a grain of salt, because he's 19. But we he may had not so much be committed. More than that. Pardon? We had so much more than that. What? what? Talk to her. <laughs> I feel like there was more thought. I mean, less so every time. conversation we had, it meant nothing? Not really. <laughs> Shouldn't you have let her know? You could have told me in the beginning. We'll be back. Yeah.